Hello. In this video, we will show you how to migrate settings and manage devices from Kaspersky Security Center to Kaspersky Security Center Cloud Console. Launch a browser and connect to your local Kaspersky Security Center administration server via port 8080. Open operations and run the migration wizard. The migration wizard will help you export your settings from Kaspersky Security Center and reconnect your computers to your workspace in the Kaspersky Security Center Cloud Console. The migration wizard consists of three steps. The first and third steps of the wizard are performed in the web console of your local Kaspersky Security Center, and the second is performed in the cloud console of Kaspersky Security Center. Select the group whose settings you want to export. You can select a specific group of managed devices, or export the settings of all groups at once. Select the applications whose tasks and policies you want to migrate to the cloud console. Policies and group tasks for unselected applications or applications that are not listed here such as Kaspersky Endpoint Security for Linux will not be exported. Although the administration server is listed, its policies will not be exported. Select the global tasks to export. The administration server's global tasks, such as download updates to the repository, backup of administration server data, database maintenance, and some others, cannot be exported, and there is no point in selecting them. It also makes no sense to export remote installation tasks because they are bound to installation packages that cannot be exported. You can export only custom selections. Check the selections you want to export. Keep in mind that the cloud console has all the same standard reports as your local console. Therefore, select for export only those reports that you created manually or reconfigured. In addition to the selected objects, the wizard exports internal user groups of Kaspersky Security Center, custom roles with access permissions, and custom application control categories. If you do not want to transfer some or all of these entities, exclude them. Save the archive with the settings to your local drive. Open another tab in the browser and connect to your workspace in the Kaspersky Security Center Cloud Console. Prior to running the migration wizard, make sure that the language of the cloud console interface is the same as the language of your web console interface. If you have completed the quick start wizard in your workspace, there will be tasks and policies with the default settings in the manage devices group. Delete these policies and tasks, you will use the policies and tasks exported from your local system instead. Run the migration wizard. Specify the location of the archive with the settings. Select the Manage Devices group. Select the installation package for which you want to create a standalone package. Choose the Kaspersky Network Agent for Windows installation package only if you have not completed the Quick Start wizard. Wait for the data to be transferred. To avoid confusion, rename the imported subgroup Managed Devices to Migrated Devices. Select the Administration Server node and open Policies and Profiles. You can see the complete list of policies configured for your workspace here.
make sure that all policies, active and inactive, have migrated and are located in proper groups. Open the Tasks tab. It contains the complete list of global and group tasks of your workspace. Switch to the Manage Devices tab. You can see the devices currently connected to your local Kaspersky Security Center administration server. Open the Installation Packages repository. It contains all the installation packages that have been loaded to the workspace. Open the list of standalone packages. Select the standalone package of Kaspersky Network Agent for Windows and save it to your computer. Return to the Kaspersky Security Center web console and proceed to the third step of the migration wizard. Select the Upload Standalone Installation Package checkbox and specify the standalone package that you have saved. To mitigate risks, we recommend that you do not migrate all computers at once. It is best to start with a small group of 10 to 20 devices, preferably without servers or computers located outside the local corporate network. Select an appropriate group where the wizard will create a network agent installation task. These computers will be disconnected from your local administration server and connected to the workspace in the Kaspersky Security Center cloud console. Complete the migration wizard and run the remote installation task. Wait for the task to complete successfully. Connect to one of the computers where the network agent of Kaspersky Security Center Cloud Console has been installed. Open a command prompt as an administrator. Run the klnagchk.x utility with the minus send hb parameter. Make sure the network agent has successfully connected to the administration server of your workspace in the Kaspersky Security Center cloud console. Note that the connection port and administration server address have been received from the hosted discovery service. The network agent does not use port 13000 to connect to the administration server in the workspace. If the network agent was unable to connect to the administration server, make sure that connections to asterisk ksc.kaspersky.com on TCP ports 443, 23100 to 23199, and 27200 to 27299 are allowed from your network. Return to the web console of Kaspersky Security Center. To complete the migration, remotely install the network agent of Kaspersky Security Center Cloud Console on other network computers.